Hey guys, happy Wednesday. I can't believe it's already Wednesday, but at the same time, I'm like, it's only Wednesday. <laughs> uh, this weekend was pretty crazy. Both of the kids ended up getting sick. Brody was sick like Thursday night and Friday. He threw up all night Thursday night, pretty much like, okay, not all night, but he threw up like four times, which is a lot for a little kid, you know. We kept him home Friday, obviously, because I'm not gonna send my kid to school who was just throwing up the night before, but it was really weird because he woke up, he seemed fine. We only gave him some toast for breakfast because I didn't wanna, you know, I didn't want to push it too much. I wanted to kind of test the waters first to see how that would settle in his stomach. But yeah, he seemed fine. He was playing fine, acting fine, fighting with Peyton just fine. Like he seemed like he really could honestly have gone to school. But obviously I didn't send him. So he kind of just hung out at home all day. And then towards the evening, I could tell he was starting not to really feel that well again. He was just kind of sitting on the couch and just not really acting the same. And so I felt his forehead and he had a little bit of a fever. So gave him some medicine. And then once that medicine was in his, in his system, he felt fine and started playing again. But then as it got closer to bedtime, the fever started coming back. So we gave it to him one more time before he went to bed. Then he woke up the next day and was completely fine, felt fine, ate fine, everything was good. So Saturday we went out and we went to Best Buy. Um, we bought we bought new computers, so now I have a laptop that I can edit my videos on, which I'm super excited about. And then we also bought a new camera. Um, they didn't have it in stock though, so I am waiting for it to come. But I bought a camera, a tripod, a camera case, and extra battery. So the extra battery already arrived because that had to be ordered too. And so now I'm just waiting on the camera to come. I bought everything else in store, but I'm really excited to have a camera. I have not owned an actual camera since, oh my gosh, I was in high school. <laughs> I've just been using my phone for pictures and all that stuff. So I'm really excited to have a nice camera that I can take nice pictures of the kids on. I can vlog on. So that'll be fun. After that, we came home and kind of, you know, just relaxed for the evening, had dinner, and then after dinner time, Peyton started complaining that her stomach hurt. And I was like, oh no, I know what this is. So when we put her to bed that night, you know, she was, I mean, she was still playing fine and stuff, but she just every once in a while would say that her stomach hurt. And so before she went to bed, I put her hair up in a ponytail because I was trying to prepare. I wish I would have like laid down a towel and like a trash can and stuff, but I was like, we'll just do the ponytail. Well, she ended up getting sick, I think, as she was sleeping because she threw up like right on her pillow. Like, not like if you would have like gotten up and turned around, it was kind of like she was laying down and it came out. Um, and then she also threw up again on her bedspread. Yeah, so um, while Brad was giving her a shower because it had gotten all over her, I was changing out her bed and we actually ended up throwing her bed stuff away because it was, it was so bad. It was gross. She had had hot dogs for dinner. So I'm sure you can imagine how pleasant that was. But yeah, so I, we ended up throwing that stuff away. We luckily had extra bedding and stuff for her. So used that. And then I did set up a towel on the floor, set up the trash can and told her, you know, if you feel like you're gonna throw up again, just throw up in this trash can. So we ended up going in and out of her room about, I wanna say like four or five times that night for, cause she was throwing up. So then Sunday, all day Sunday, she was still not feeling the best and everything. But then by Monday, everybody was fine again. So yeah, it was kind of not really the funnest weekend that we were hoping to have after Brad came home, but it, it was fine. <laughs> um, so yeah, so I'm glad that it's Wednesday because hopefully this weekend we will actually be able to get to do some fun things since nobody is sick anymore. Uh, so last night I took my Lush box um, that all my Lush products had come in and I cut it up and put it 
It had a really cute design on the box. Like it was like different plants and flowers and stuff. And so I cut it up and I put it on her calico critter house for like wallpaper. I made the mistake of accidentally leaving the scissors in Peyton's room. And so somebody decided to give herself a little haircut. <laughs> Luckily, you can't tell right off the bat, but she uh, trimmed her bangs here a little bit. Just that little piece yeah. right there and probably some other little some other little pieces, but yes. Oh yeah, right there, you can see really good. So she uh, gave herself some bangs. So when we uh, go to the hairdresser here soon, we'll have to give her bangs again so this can grow out. But luckily it wasn't like, you know, a drastic cut because that would not have been good. But we're not gonna play with scissors anymore, huh? Yeah. Yeah, we're not. We're not. <laughs> so yes, fun weekend. Yeah, just uh, waiting for Brad to come home for lunch. Peyton and I are, are watching um, Hey Dougie and Snowplow just went by. It snowed last night, so I'm ready for spring. I got my house all decorated for spring. I really like it. I, I especially like my little peep pillows. Um, I did upload a vlog on that, a little Easter slash spring haul. So if you haven't seen that yet, I will link it down below and you can check it out. Hi, you cute boy. You good boy. All right, so woke Peyton up from her nap and now she just had snack. Brody should be home any minute. Brad is actually home early. He's never home this early, but he is today, which is really nice because like I said, he's never home this early anymore. So we're going to run to the commissary as soon as Brody gets home. And he's probably not gonna be very happy about that because he doesn't really like going places after school, but we need some groceries, so he's gonna have to deal. But I wanted to show you guys this cute project that Brody did the other day. Um, he made this George Washington, and when you flip it over, it makes Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> Super cute project that he did. And then he made this really cute grocery list too. So this says banana, then we have corn, <laughs> tomato, peppers, and oranges. <laughs> So I'm definitely gonna be keeping that forever because that is adorable to me. <laughs> um, but yeah, it is time for us to go outside and wait for Brody and then we will head to the commissary. Hi, we're in the car. Where'd we just leave? From the commissary, but, oh, it's sunny. There are, and they're actually still there. Where are we going? Home. And I love the play! What? I love to play. Oh. <laughs> so, the exciting part is we're going to go home and play together. Me and Nene together. Mm -hmm. I can't play! Are you cold? I'm frozen. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, going home from the commissary. It is cold. Very, very, very cold. I just want to be there when to warm up. I'm oh, grumpy. All right, so back from the grocery store and we spent about $100 this time and we got some more chocolate dipped chewy bars for the kids. Brody needed some more yogurt raisins. We also got some apples and we like to get the Fuji kind. And then we had to stock up on our beef smoked sausage. We got two this time since Brad is home and we will definitely be having more of that. Eggs for the sausage as well. Then we got some cereal, we got cocoa pebbles cinnamon toast crunch and some cocoa puffs and the cinnamon toast crunch comes with the pokemon cards again so the kids will like that a lot and then we got this for the first time last time it's this rotisserie seasoned chicken breast and it turned out to be really good so we are definitely making this our go-to right now and then we also got some pickles brad wanted a pop 
and then we also got the kids these normally we get them the hello kitty ones but they didn't have chocolate so they picked out these ones they're pretty much the same thing anyway they just don't have hello kitty on them then we got two of these cheese curds brad loves to eat these for snacks then we got some more hot dogs the kids needed some more whole wheat bread and then I got some more YoPlay French vanilla yogurt, and I like to put my chocolate chips in those. And I also will just snack on these every once in a while for a little snack. Needed some more ketchup. We also got some pancake mix. And then the other day, Sarah Jessica Parker posted a Instagram of some English muffins that looked really good. And ever since then, I've been craving them. So <laughs> we bought some. We needed some more white rice, and we really like these boil-in-a-bag ones. Then Brad needed some coffee, and I will now know from now on that it is the Nantucket Blend Medium Roast. <laughs> if I ever forget, I can watch this video. <laughs> and then Brody picked out some Spider-Man gummies. He's all about the gummies for lunch. And then we picked up a couple waffles for the kids' breakfast. Super easy to do, especially on school mornings. Then we got some more Ritz crackers some chocolate milk because you know we go through that very very quickly and then we also got some red baron pizzas we got this supreme pizza a pepperoni pizza and a cheese pizza so we will probably have these for dinner tonight so it will be an easy night Daddy, turn on something. Lights. How about this? Lights activated. Lights! So as I was editing my video tonight, I realized I never made a goodbye portion of my vlog. So I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here so I can go to bed and finish editing my video so I can get it up for you guys tomorrow. Well, technically it would be today, but um, I'm going to go to bed. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. It really means a lot. Those of you that take the time out of your day to watch my videos. So know that it is appreciated and I really hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye.